Good? Okay, good to go. Good morning. Welcome everybody to chair yoga. Let's all stand today. We're going to start standing position. <clears throat> Give yourself an inhale, reach up. Exhale, hands to your heart. Inhale, reach up, welcoming this new day, this new experience. Inhale, and exhale. Breathing in fully, consciously, beautiful breath. Exhale all the way out. Inhale, and exhale softly. And then bring your arms down to the side, shake them out a little. Move your knees, just give yourself a shake. Shake off any areas of stress or tension you have in the body. Just shake it up. Let, let your hands go, go to one side and the other. Just shake it out. Yeah, beautiful. And now we're going to take our feet a little wide, hands to the hips, and circle your hips around. Forward, side, back, the other side. As we circle our hips, we're moving the femur bone in the hip socket, juicing up the joints. Hello to our hips, happy hips. Let's do the other side. Go the other way, yeah. Notice how your hips are feeling today and give them some love. Hips always need a lot of love. Yes, these areas tend to get tight and stiff. So come back to center. Bring your feet just a little bit together. Take the arms to the side and then swing your arms. Move your spine. Swing, swing. You got it. Swing it around. And now let's tap our shoulders. Tap, tap. Moving the hands up to the shoulders. Tap, yes. Tap, tap. Tap. Now we're going to alternate. Tap shoulders, tap waist, tapping low, then tap shoulders, tap shoulders, and waist, and waist. Two times each side. Shoulders, shoulders, waist, or your hips down low. Shoulders, shoulders, and waist, waist. Shoulders, Shoulders, waist, waist. Great. And then this swing. Now from here, take your hands to your shoulders. Circle. Big circles. Forward, up, and back. Forward, up, and back. Move them around. See how close you could get them together and how far apart you could get your shoulders. Healthy, happy shoulders. How are yours doing today? All good? Smile into your shoulders. And now let's reverse it the other way. Breathe. Move how it feels good in your body. After this exercise, we can rest, but now we're just gonna work to the best of our ability. And release it, shake it out, shake it out. Beautiful. Now let's come to the back of the chair and bring the arms forward. Make sure that your legs are right behind your chair so that we're going to sit. So now take your time. Sit slowly for five, four, three, two, one. Lengthen your spine and now we're going to come back up. Reach the arms forward. Sit up. Five, four, three, two, one. Let the hands go down. We're going to do this four more times. Reach forward and then slowly sit. Five, four, three, two, one. Come back up slowly. Five, four, three, two, one. Reach up and get right into it. Sitting low. Five, four, three, two, one. Take a deep breath in, deep breath out. <sighs> two more times. Come back up. Reach five, four, three, two, one. And sit slowly. Five, four, three, two, one. Great. One more time, just like that. Take an inhale. 
Exhale. Standing up. Five, four, three, two, one. And sit it slowly. Five, four, three, two, one. Hands down. Shake out your legs a little bit. Move them around. And now scooch forward in your chair. So you don't want your back against the back of the chair. You want to sit up nice and tall. Roll your shoulders up. And then exhale them down. Let the arms straight down. Roll the shoulders up. Inhale. Exhale. Ha. Inhale. Exhale. Ha. One more. Inhale. Exhale. Ha. Now bring the hands back to the thighs. Chin to your chest. Exhale. Inhale. Look up all the way. Exhale. Down. Inhale up, maybe look up to the sky, lift your heart. Exhale down, chin to chest, we're stretching the back of the neck. When you inhale, look up, we're stretching in the front of the throat. Exhale down, inhale up. Come to neutral spine, nice and long, look over one shoulder. Come back to center. Flip over the other shoulder, juicing up the neck bones. Look over the shoulder, center. Look over the shoulder, center. Let's get our arms involved. Look over the shoulder, reach the opposite arm away. Come back to center. Look over the shoulder, reach the other arm away. Come back to center. We're gonna reach, look over and center, reach, look over, and center, reach, look over, center, reach, look over, and center. Great, let's reach both arms out wide. Circle your wrist, big circles, big circles, like a butterfly just spreading its wings. Circle in the other direction, circle, circle, circle. Now, come back together, Clasp your hands in front of you, and we're going to do a little chop. So bring your forearms together, bend and chop. Bend and forward. Bend and forward. Great, bend and forward. So now we're gonna take these arms, and we're gonna scooch the waist to the side and reach. Bend, come to center. Scooch to the other side and reach. Then come back to center, twice each side. Reach, center, reach, center, reach, center, reach, center, and forward. Hands forward, now hands down, hands up, hands down, hands up, hands down. Hands gonna come up this way, stretch them forward, Take your, right, your pointer finger to the thumb and open wide. Middle finger to the thumb, open wide. Ring finger to the thumb, open wide. Pinky finger to the thumb, open wide. All the fingers squeeze, open wide. Now pinky to the thumb, open wide. Ring finger to the thumb, open wide. Middle finger to the thumb, open wide. Point your finger to the thumb, open wide. Now all the fingers to the thumbs and circle. Keep them circle, squeeze them together. Do it the other way, circle, circle, circle. Bring your hands to your shoulders and now backs of the hands towards your knees. Hands to your shoulders, backs of the hands to the knees. We're gonna do this for five, four, three, two, and one. Take the arms wide, and we're gonna stretch by holding the fingers down. Stretch the arm nice and long, all the way to the front. Great. And now we're going to reverse it, bring your fingers down, and just wiggle your fingers while you're there, so you're stretching on the top of the arm. Let's do the other side. Press the fingers down, make sure that you can feel that nice stretch all through the front. Press, and now reverse it. Take your hands down and wiggle your fingers while you're there. Yeah. And 
from here, just shake it out. Shake out the hands. Shake in one direction. Shake in the other direction. Shake it loose. We're also shaking off any areas of stress and tension in the arms. Beautiful. Take the arms up, inhale. Exhale, hands together in front of your heart. And just notice how the upper body is feeling with the movements we've just done. Getting the blood flow. Now let's work in our legs. Taking one hand down, reach up, grab one leg. And from here, circle your ankle. Circle. Sit up nice and tall as you circle your ankle. Circle in the other direction. Circle, circle, circle. And take hold of your shin and interlacing the hands, press. Great. From here, we're going to move that leg around in the hip socket. You got it. Just move in the hip socket. You can circle any direction. Hold your leg wherever it feels most comfortable for you today. All right. Now, taking that same leg, stretch it long. Stretch and then bend. Bring it back in. Stretch and bend. You got it. Stretch and bend. Again, stretch and bend. One more. Stretch and bend. And this time we're going to stretch the leg long. Maybe release your hands and bend. Press. Release the hands higher and press. Two more. Stretch and press. Stretch and press it in and release it down. Take that same leg and cross the ankles. From the crossing of the ankles, we're going to reach one hand down, opposite hand forward, and then open wide into a twist. Great. Our first twist of the day. Yay! Reach that same arm up. Hold, and then look, give yourself a little tilt over to the side. Feel that stretch all the way up the side of the body. Ah, oh, that's a good one. And release it down. Take your legs, unravel them, and let's do a little march. And a march, march it out. Great. Marching. A little tap with the toes. Tap and bicep curl. Tap, 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 and tap. Tap, 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 and tap. Now kick, kick and reach, kick and reach. Great. And hold your knee, tap your knee, and rest. Now the other side. Let's get to the other leg. Lift it up. Circle your ankle. Draw your belly in, sit up nice and tall. Try not to have your back against the chair so you use your muscles to hold the body up. Circle in the other direction. Great, you got it. Happy ankles, hello ankle. How are you today? Doing good? Good. Great. So here, hands to your shin and press. Lift, lengthen and lift. From there, stretch the leg long. Hold it and bend. Hold and bend. And if there's any achiness, tension in the body, sometimes the best thing to do is to work through those things to help the body to heal itself. Now we're gonna stretch the leg long, release the leg, get into those muscles and press and hold. Stretch, reach up high and press and hold. Stretch, reach up high, press and hold. The muscles are saying, hello, I love you, you're taking good care of me. And hold. One more, stretch, hold, and release it down. That's a lot of work for the hip flexors. Take that same leg and cross. From there, hold the leg, reach that arm forward, and open wide into a twist on this side. Looking back behind you, Lengthen your spine and feel the twist. Enjoy the sensation. Come back to center. Unravel your legs and we're going to march it out again. Let's march for five, four, three, two, and one. Now tap toes. Tap toes and tap your shoulders at the same time. Five, four, three, two, and one. Now we're going to kick and reach. Kick. Kick. Five, four, three, two, and one. Now tap your knees. Tap, tap. Five, four, three, two, and one. Great. Release out of that. Stretch 
stretch any leg long in front of you. So we're flexing the toes up. Lift from your waist and lean forward. Let's get a nice stretch in that leg. Windshield wiper your foot side to side, your toes, and feel that movement all the way up your leg. Yeah, good stretch for the hamstring. We're also juicing up the joints. Lean forward a little more and reach your opposite arm towards your toes or even beyond your toes. Great. And then slowly come out of it. Bend the leg. Take that same leg and scooch it to the side. Have your foot planted down. Have the leg out as much as is comfortable for you. We're going to take the opposite arm up. Reach and then glide your hand down your leg and have a nice side stretch on this side. Feeling that all the way up and over. Take your shoulder now and circle around, down and up, reach high. Look at your fingers all the way down and around and up and reach. One more, circle down, around and up, Reach overhead, keep that reach. Now take the arm that's on your leg and reach out wide, yay. From there, take both arms and circle them down, around, all the way up and over and stretch. Imagine the bamboo in a big meadow and they're flowing with the wind. We're reaching up and over or some beautiful flowers flowing in the wind. We're all like this wonderful garden. Reach up high and hands to your heart. Release that. Great. Take your hands down. Bring your leg back in. You can heel toe it there. And just let's march it in. March. March. Tap toes. Tap. Tap. Five, four, three, two, and one. Now kick and reach. Kick and reach, five, four, three, two, and one. Now tap your knee, and notice as you're tapping your knee, you're making a little twist, four, three, two, and one. Now we're going to take this opposite leg and reach the other leg forward. Flex your foot a lot so you can really feel a bit of a stretch already. Then lift your spine. Lengthen and lean forward, forward. Moving from your hips, great. Feel a nice stretch. Now windshield wiper your, let, your foot. As you windshield wiper the toe side to side, the movement's happening all the way up your leg. You got it. Give yourself a deep breath in. Lean a little more forward and reach towards your toes. Feeling the stretch in your leg, maybe even in your lower back a little bit. Great, come back up, bend the knee, and now take that same leg and just scooch it out. Maybe the knee is bent, maybe you can straighten it out and plant the foot down at an angle so your toes are facing forward, you got it. We're going to reach the opposite arm straight up and then the arm by your leg is gonna come down, down, down. Reach up and over, over, over. Start to feel that stretch all the way through the side. Relaxing the shoulders, great. Now let's circle that arm out. Circling down, around, and all the way up. Look towards your fingertips. Circle down, around, and up. Hello. Two more. Circle down, around, and up. One more. Down, around, and up. Feel that reach. Now keep that. Take this arm and stretch it out wide. We're using our abdominal strength to hold the body. Circle the arms down, around, and up. Beautiful flowers flowing in the wind. Circling again. Creating a nice, big, flowing movement. One more. And from here, we're going to stretch back up, reach up toward the sun, and hands together in front of your heart. Beautiful. Take your hands down, scooching your leg. 
over to the side. And from here, we're going to lift our heels, bring your feet close together. Lift the heels up all the way. Maybe come your feet a little closer and come onto your tippy toes. Really pointing your toes down, down, down. And then relax the heels down. Lift them up and down. Lift them up and down again. Up and down, up and down. And so now bring your feet a little closer so that the ankle is in line with your knee. Lift the heels a little bit, open the heels wide, close and down. Lift, open, close and down. Lift, open, close, down. Lift, open, close, down. Lift, open, close, down. So good for the ankles to do this kind of movement. We're strengthening in our ankle joints, our, all of the bones in the feet, well most of them, we have a lot of bones in the feet as well as the calf muscles, relax. Now, taking our feet closer a little bit, lift just your toes so the heels are facing down and then lower. Lift the toes and lower. So now we're working the front part of your lower leg, strengthening in that area, keeping the heels down on the ground. Just lift the toes. Now, we'll lift the toes, Open just the toes, keep your heels together, and close and tap. Do that again. Lift, open, close, tap. Lift, open, close, tap. Lift, open, close, tap. Are you still sitting up nice and tall, or has the body gone down? No, we want to sit up tall. Yes, keep sitting up tall with these movements. Great, now we're going to add it together. So, let's now hold the whole thing. Lift your heels, open wide, close the heels, tap down, lift your toes, open wide, tap and down. Lift heels, open, tap and down. Lift toes, open, tap, down. Lift heels, open, tap, down. Lift toes, open, tap, down. Don't your feet look amazing right now? Lift, open, close, down. Lift, open, close, down. Lift, open, close, down. Lift, Open, close, down, lift, open, close, down, lift. We could do this all day. We won't, but let's do a little more. And then release, Woo, shake it out, beautiful. All right, so now from here, relax that. Let's get into our shoulders again. Take your hands down, and then one at a time, up and back, up and back, up and back, up and back. Move it around, move your elbow back, elbow back. The whole shoulder. Let's make bigger movements, bigger movements, as if we're doing the backstroke. Look at your fingertips, up and back, up and back, up and back, up and back. And now the other way, reverse it. Forward, 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 forward. Welcome, my new friends. Forward, forward. Now let's make it bigger. Bigger movements like we're swimming in a pool or in a lake or the ocean, wherever you like to swim, maybe even your bathtub, just pretend like we're just splashing around in water. Notice as we're here, we're not leaning back, we're leaning a little forward so that we're getting into our abdominals. And rest, inhale, exhale. Deep breath in, deep breath out. <sighs> another, another. Inhale, exhale. Great. So we're balancing movement with a little bit of rest in between. Now we're going to get into our core muscles. Take one hand behind your head, bring the other hand down, and take your feet a little wide. We're going to get into the side body here. So, with the feet wide, you have a base. You're going to reach down, tilt, like a tea kettle. Yes, and down. Let's do this 10 times. 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5. We're moving from the waist. 4, 3, 2, and 1. Great. Now we're going to take hold of the thigh. Plant this foot 
it down. Take hold of your thigh. Your elbows out wide. Inhale, then exhale. Bring that knee up and tap your knee a little bit. Inhale and exhale. Inhale and exhale. Let's do 10. 10, 9, 8, 7, 6. Think about your shoulder coming towards that leg. So you don't even have to move your neck. What number are we up to? Five, four, three, two, and one. Rest. Inhale. Exhale. Since we worked in this leg so much, we're going to scooch over so that this leg that we were working is going to be on the outside of the chair and hold the chair. So make sure the leg that you were moving is the outside leg. And now scooch that leg down, down, down. So we're going to stretch in the hip flexor. Scooch your foot back as much as is comfortable. Reach the arm up to the sky. Lift up. Stretch your leg back. A little lean back. Lift up. And then let your arm come way out to the side. So keep holding your chair. Reach. And now tap your chair in front of you. And open wide. Tap your chair in front of you. Open wide. Great. Two more. Tap and open. Tap and open. Now we're going to reach up and over and out wide. Reach up and over, out wide. Once again, reach up and over, out wide. Now let's put it together. Reach back and tap. Reach to the side, up and over. Reach back and tap. Reach to the side and over. One more. Reach back and tap. Reach to the side and up and rest. Take that leg, scooch it back. Come back to center. Give yourself an inhale. And exhale. Great. And now we can work the other side. So I'm going to take my other hand towards the back. You can hold the back of your head or you can even hold your shoulder because you don't want to think about moving your head. It's all about moving your waist and your shoulder. So see which one feels better for you. We're going to reach down. That's when we get to the other exercise. Right now we're going to take the feet wide, reach down and up. Reach down and up. Let's do 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3. Smile at your happy waist, getting stronger. And 2, and 1. Great. Now we're going to do the exercise where we take the leg, stretch a little bit. You can hold your head or your neck, but notice the head is neutral. We're going to bring the shoulder in and over and extend. Bring it in and extend. Squeeze the belly. Let's do 10, 9, 8. You can lift the leg a little bit or a lot. You don't have to do a, a, the way that I'm doing it. Do how it feels very comfortable in your own body. Great. Let's do another four. Three, two, and one. Wonderful. Rest. Take now, this leg is going to be on the outside. So we're going to scooch to the other side. Hold the back of your chair. Scooch so that you can bring that leg straight down. From at bringing the leg straight down, you're getting a stretch in your hip flexor. Reach your arm up. And then reach over your head. You got it, yeah. Let's reach out to the side, tap your chair, and open wide. And we'll do this a few times. Tap your chair, twist, open wide, tap, and open, tap, and open. One more, tap, and open. Now let's reach up and over, two more, up, and over again, up, 
and over. Now let's put it all together. Tap your chair, open wide, reach up, open wide. Tap your chair, open wide, reach up, open wide. Tap your chair, open wide, reach up, open wide. One more. Tap your chair, open wide, reach up, open wide, and rest. Take your hand down and scooch that leg back, and now come back to center. Let's sit all the way back in the chair. Lengthen the spine up, reach up, and bring hands together in front of your heart. Close the eyes for just a few moments. Notice how the body feels with this movement you've just done. Smile at yourself for doing this work, for showing up for yourself, for taking care of your body, your mind. All right, let's get into some yoga sun salutations. We're going to scooch forward from the chair, lift the spine, root your feet down to the ground. On the inhale, reach up to the sky. On the exhale, hands to your heart. Let's reach straight up to the sky and then cactus your arms out wide. So we're bending at the elbows. And now lean forward slightly with a long spine. Take your hands down. We're gonna do our first forward fold. Slide your hands down the legs with a long spine. You can look forward or if it's comfortable in your body, take your head and let it drape down. From here, let's come all the way back up. As we come up with a long spine, we're gonna arch our spine. Take your hands towards your hips, elbows in, and lift your heart, look up. So we're arching, and now slide your hands back to your forward fold, all the way back down. From here, circle your arms out and up, reach high to the sky. Let's find a twist. Take your hands to either side, twist. Inhale, reach up. Exhale into your twist on the other side, great. Inhale, reach up, and exhale, cactus arms. Lean it forward again. We're going to put some of this together. Hands touch down. Come back up. Hold your knees, lean forward. Take one hand to the inside of your leg. Press it there. The other arm is going to go straight out wide. The hand that's on your leg, you can stretch down and stretch up. Now reverse it. Take the other arm in your leg. Circle the other arm up. Reach high. Feel a twist. Reach down and up at the same time. It's okay. You can hold your shoulder. And release that hand down. Slowly come back up. Reach high. And bring hands together in front of the heart. Great. Let's put it all together in the flow. Inhale, up. Exhale, cactus arm, lean forward. Bring your hands to your knees and forward fold. Look forward or you can look down. Come up all the way, arch your spine, elbows in, lift your heart. Then exhale, fold forward. As you inhale, circle the arms around and up. Reach high, twist, exhale. Inhale back to center. Exhale into a twist. Inhale back to center. And exhale. Circle the arms down and fold forward. Take one hand to the inside of your leg and circle the arm up. Take the other hand down and circle the arm up. Reach down, exhale. Let's take a deep breath in, reach high to the sky, and bring hands together in front of the heart. So from here, we're gonna add something else. Stretch one leg long, reach up high. Hands to your heart, stretch the other leg long, reach up to the sky. 
hands to your heart. Great. Circle the arms around and up. Cactus arms. Lean forward. Plant your hands down and forward fold. Inhale, arch your spine. Look all the way up. Bring your hands towards your hips. And let's forward fold once again. Take one arm to the inside. The other arm reaches up. Take one arm down. The other arm will reach up. Bring that hand down. Forward fold. Circle the arms up all the way up. And now twist. Hold the side of the chair, look over the shoulder. Reach up and twist. Hold the other side of your chair. Reach up and hands together in front of your heart. Beautiful. Let's do one more round. Inhale, circle the arms up. Exhale, hands to your heart. Reach up, lift one leg, stretch. And hands down. Reach up, stretch, and hands down. Circle the arms up, inhale, cactus the arms and lean forward. From there, plant your hands and fold forward. Inhale, look all the way up, arch your spine, exhale, back down. Take one hand to the inside of your leg, circle the other arm up, reach. Take your hands down. Other arm is going to lift and reach. Hands touch down. Circle the arms around and up. Inhale. Let's twist. Exhale. Beautiful. Inhale. Reach up. Exhale. Twist. Inhale. Lift. And bring hands together in front of your heart. Beautiful. Smile at your happy heart and all the work that you've done. And bring the hands down to your thighs and let's roll the shoulders. Roll it up. Beautiful. Let's stand. We're going to do a little work standing. Shake out your legs, shake out your hands, and we're going to come to stand. Stand at one side of your chair, any side, because we're going to do both sides. I'm going to take a quick of water. All right. Hydration is very important. Make sure to drink a lot after your class. So from here, hold one side of the chair. The other side is going to hold your waist. You're going to tap this same leg out to the side and then lean in towards that chair. Lift your leg and lower. Lift your leg and lower straight out. Let's do it 10 times. 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, and 1. Hold it out there. Let's challenge. Maybe we're going to reach the other arm straight out. Maybe one finger down. Find a little balance, 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 and release it. Yay! Step the other leg, the leg forward. Working on a little balance technique here. Hands forward, lift both heels and release. Lift both heels and release. Lift both heels and release. Now we're going to lift the heels and little baby pulses. Five, four, three, two, and one. Great. From here, Let's take the hand down to start, then lift back up again, take the arm out wide, and find your balance. Hold the chair with one finger, two fingers, no fingers, no hands, maybe hands to your heart, and release. Yay! Very nice. Hold the chair once again, take that same leg, bend the knee up, tap your knee or hold somewhere, out and in. Out and in. Out and in again. Out and in. One more. Out and in and release. Now we're going to kick the leg back. So we're going to bring the knee up and back. Up. Kick back. Don't kick your neighbors. <laughs> you don't want to kick any, unless you really want to, but I, I won't suggest that. Let's do two more. 